Yo, what's going on guys? It's iHelper, and today I'm bringing you guys part 2 of the top tweaks series that support the iOS 10.1.1 jailbreak. So for the first tweak we have here, it's called Blurry Badges, and as you can see by my 22,000 mail application, the way the badges look, I think it's a really nice and clean look, and it just fits right in with the iOS. Um, it looks really nice, and it basically just turns the color into any app that you have a notification from. So the next week we have is breadcrumbs away and breadcrumbs are basically the thing up in the top left of the status bar with that little arrow when you get redirected and you can tap it to take you back. You basically can just swipe away and it will, it will, um, it will take the breadcrumbs away. So that's called breadcrumbs away. Now the second tweak we have here is called the cream two. And as you can see, it basically does the same thing as cream did if you remember from the 9.3.3 jailbreak where you can customize the colors of your control center icons and if we come back down into the cream 2 configurations you have a lot of options you can configure and then you just need to respring once you're done so the next week we have is called custom carrier and as you guys can see up in my carrier at the top left I usually have sprint up there but I have the flash up there for this video um, uh, I don't know why I just checked the sub count it's just a habit because this you guys have been killing it lately with that last video the last week's video has almost two I think it has 2,000 views now and I got like 30 subs off that video so you guys are just killing it almost almost 30 likes as well um, so it made me so happy to see that video do so well. Um, but anyways, yeah, custom carrier. You come in. You can just change your carrier like that. It's basically like fake carrier if you guys are jailbroken around like iOS 6 when that was out. It's the same thing. And then you can just hit the apply changes. Let me know down in the comments if any of you guys watched The Flash. I love that show. Okay, the next tweak we have is called Delete Cut. And what this tweak does is basically if you have a bunch of stuff typed out, you hold the shift button and you can see how my delete key turned blue. If I hit shift and then I hit the delete button, it'll delete an entire word instead of just um instead of just the single uh, key. So that's a really useful tweak if you're trying to learn how to type fast. Or not really type fast, but just like, it saves you time. Okay, so the next tweak we have here is called Fingal. And I'm pretty sure you guys have noticed by now the way my icons are moving, how YouTube is moving, how Messages is animated. All these apps in here are animated, Snapchat, Facebook, um, Twitter so that's basically what Fingal does but you're going to need a theme right now my theme is called shake it but you will also have to download separately inside of Cydia so keep that in mind when you're downloading this tweak but it's a really nice touch and I really like it the next tweak we have is no slow animations now I know you guys probably saw this on every single tweak video but as you guys can see it just is really fast and it just saves you a whole bunch of time okay so the next week we have call is called spin settings now I don't know if Fingal has a settings um, a settings animation or not because I have a separate tweak called spin settings and as you guys can see it just has the little settings icon spinning around you guys can change how fast or how slow it goes in the options right here you can just read what it says right there and it changes on whatever you like so the next tweak we have is actually a Cydia tweak well obviously but it's a tweak for Cydia and it is called swipe for more so basically if I just come over and I look up hold on uh, Cydia reload data sorry for that glare by the way Okay, if I just look up cylinder and then I swipe over on it, you'll see you have all these options to queue, uninstall, queue, reinstall, 
reinstall and then uninstall. So that's basically what Swipe for More does. And okay, my uh, my recording just lagged really bad right there. I don't know what happened, but I got scared and thought I was gonna have to restart, which kind of sucks because I like the way this video is going. But yeah, that's swipe for more. Now this next tweak we have is called cuttlefish and as you guys can see what cuttlefish does is it changes the tint of the instead of that just plain gray tint when you 3d touch on an application it changes it to the application color so as you can see if we 3d touch on itunes it'll turn it pink if we 3d touch on calculator it'll turn it kind of this orange brownish color if we 3d touch on settings it'll stay that same normal gray color Really nice tweak, I really like the way it looks. Now for this next tweak is called Flat Safari URL. And basically it just, instead of having those separator bars up in the Safari, uh, up in the URL bar, or the address bar, it gets rid of those and it has a really nice clean look and it's it fits right in iOS. I can't believe, because it, it reminds me so much of Mac OS. I can't believe Apple didn't put that in like normally yet. Alright guys, so that's pretty much it for this quick, uh, well not quick little update video I almost said. Uh, that's pretty much it for this tweak video. Leave a like if you guys enjoyed it. Maybe even drop a subscribe if you're interested in seeing more content like this. And I'll catch you guys in the next video. Peace.